Hey everyone and welcome to Bitfor's channel. In this video we are going to learn about crypto language and break down difficult terms for you. All the terms are listed in A to Z order, so you can find your target terms easily in the future if needed. But before getting to know these terms, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to get notified of the future videos. Altcoin Any cryptocurrency other than Bitcoin An altcoin is an alternative digital currency to Bitcoin. The word altcoin is a portmanteau of alternative and coin to form altcoin. It actually refers to a group of cryptocurrencies, ultimately all the cryptocurrencies other than Bitcoin. ASIC Application-Specific Integrated Circuit an ASIC is a powerful and expensive computing device used for mining cryptocurrency. All-time high, ATH. The highest price ever achieved by a cryptocurrency. All-time low, ATL. The lowest price ever achieved by a cryptocurrency. Addresses. Every cryptocurrency coin has a unique address that identifies where it sits on the blockchain. It's this address, this location, at which the coin's ownership data is stored and where any changes are registered when it is traded. These addresses differ in appearance between cryptocurrencies but are usually a string of over 30 characters. Arbitrage There are multiple exchanges at any given time trading in the same cryptocurrency and they can do so at different rates. Arbitrage is the act of buying from one exchange and then selling it to the next exchange if there is a margin between the two that is profitable. Airdrop A distribution of tokens by the operators of a cryptocurrency network. The tokens are either given away to all holders of the cryptocurrency for free or conditioned by some sort of activity such as promoting the crypto on a social network. Bear or bearish if the price of a cryptocurrency has a negative price movement. Bull or bullish. If the price of a cryptocurrency has a positive price movement. Bear trap. This is a trick played by a group of traders aimed at manipulating the price of a cryptocurrency. The bear trap is set by this group all selling their cryptocurrency at the same time, which bluffs the market into thinking there is a drop incoming. As a result, other traders sell their assets further driving the price down. Those who set the trap then release it, buying back their assets, which are now at a lower price. The overall price then rebounds, allowing them to make a profit. Bull Trap In stock market trading, a bull trap is an inaccurate signal that shows a decreasing trend in a stock or index has reversed and is now heading upwards, when in fact, the security will continue to decline. It is seen as a trap because the bullish investor purchases the stock, thinking it will increase in value, but is trapped with a poor performing stock whose value is still falling. Bull Market The term bull market refers to a positive trend in the prices of a market. It is broadly used not only in the cryptocurrency space, but also in the traditional markets. In short, a bull market concerns to a strong market uptrend that presents meaningful rising prices over a relatively short period of time. When compared to traditional markets, cryptocurrency markets are smaller and consequently more volatile. Therefore, it is quite common to see strong and consistent bull runs, where a 40% price increase in one or two days is quite common. Bear Market A bear market is when a market experiences prolonged price declines. It typically describes a condition in which securities prices fall 20% or more from recent highs amid widespread pessimism and negative investor sentiment. So the term bear market refers to a negative trend in the prices of a market. It is widely used not only in the cryptocurrency space, but also in the traditional markets, such as stocks, bonds, real estate, and commodities markets. Breakout in technical analysis, a breakout refers to the price of an asset moving above a resistance area or below a support area. A breakout may indicate that the price of the asset will start trending in the direction of the breakout. Blockchain The blockchain is a digital ledger of all the transactions in a particular cryptocurrency ever made. It comprises of individual blocks that are chained to each other through a cryptographic signature. 
Each time a block's capacity is reached, a new block is added to the chain. The blockchain is repeatedly copied and saved onto thousands of computers all around the world and must always match each other. As there is no master copy stored in one location, it's considered decentralized. Bitcoin, the very first cryptocurrency. It was first created in 2008 by an individual or group of individuals operating under the name Satoshi Nakamoto. It was intended to be a peer-to-peer -peer decentralized electronic cash system block the blockchain is made up of blocks each block holds a historical database of all cryptocurrency transactions made until the block is full it's a permanent record like a bag of data that can be opened and viewed at any time btd btd is an acronym for by the dip it's spoken between traders to suggest buying a specific cryptocurrency during a price dip bitcoin dominance Bitcoin is the world's largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization and commands a large portion of the trading volume in the cryptocurrency markets. If we look at the summative market capitalizations of all the existing cryptocurrencies, then we can arrive at a total market cap valuation for the entire cryptocurrency space. Therefore, the Bitcoin dominance is described as the ratio between the market cap of Bitcoin to the rest of the cryptocurrency markets. Cryptography Advances in computer technology have made data more accessible, and although this may offer a huge advantage, it has a downside as well. Online data is exposed to many threats, including theft and corruption. Cryptography or cryptology is one solution that has made it possible to protect information from some of the risks associated with data storage and distribution. It is not to say that the concept of encrypting data is new. Even before the digital era, people have been masking messages to prevent unintended audiences from reading them. But the increased use of computing devices brought the science of encryption to a whole new level. Cryptocurrency A digital currency that is secured by cryptography and is, typically, used as a medium of exchange within a peer-to-peer -peer digital economic system. The use of cryptographic techniques is what ensures that these systems are completely immune to fraud and counterfeiting. Crypto Winter The term Crypto Winter refers to an extended period of declining or stagnant prices and negative sentiment in the cryptocurrency market. Similar to a bear stock market, Crypto Winter often sees projects with inflated value go bust, companies lay off staff, venture investments decrease, and the overall activity across the industry go down. Coin a cryptocurrency or digital cash that is independent of any other blockchain or platform. Candlestick A candlestick is a graphical representation of the price action of a trading asset. It allows chartists and traders to visualize the open, high, low, and closing prices within a specific time period. Dump The term used to describe selling all of your cryptocurrency. Deps Short for decentralized applications. Autonomous apps that operate on distributed network smart contracts, programs that automatically execute when specific conditions are met. Dollar Cost Averaging, DCA. Dollar Cost Averaging refers to the practice of investing fixed amounts at regular intervals, for instance, $20 every week. This is a strategy used by investors that wish to reduce the influence of volatility over their investment and, therefore, reduce their risk exposure. Do Your Own Research, DYOR? DYOR stands for Do Your Own Research and is a common phrase used by cryptocurrency enthusiasts. However, the acronym is not a piece of advice exclusive to the cryptocurrency ecosystem. It is commonly used throughout the internet due to how fast and easily misinformation can spread. Diamond Hands Diamond Hands is an expression that originated in online investor communities on platforms like Reddit and Twitter. It refers to holding a financial asset and not selling it, regardless of its volatility. Typically, the assets held with Diamond Hands are highly volatile, such as crypto, options, futures positions, and meme stocks. The term is a reference to diamonds being one of the hardest and most resistant natural materials. Decentralized Finance, DeFi 
DeFi stands for decentralized finance and refers to the ecosystem comprised of financial applications that are being developed on top of blockchain systems. Decentralized Exchange, DEX. An exchange which does not require users to deposit funds to start trading and does not hold the funds for the user. Instead, users trade directly from their own wallets. Fiat. A currency that has been established as a valid form of money, typically supported by a government regulation that declares it to be legal tender. The term fiat comes from the Latin and is a word used to describe a government decree, order, or resolution. By definition, fiat money is a currency that does not have any intrinsic value as it is not backed by a physical commodity and is usually made of a worthless or low-value material, such as a small piece of paper. Even so, fiat money is widely accepted as a means of payment. FOMO Short for Fear of Missing Out A popular acronym used to describe anxiety over missing out on a potential opportunity. FUD Short for fear, uncertainty, doubt. Commonly used in the crypto space as a label for spreading negative news or information. Forex, FX. Forex is a contraction of foreign exchange, referring to the global market for buying and selling currencies. The Forex market is indisputably the largest and most liquid financial market in the world, boasting trillions of dollars in trading volume a day. Fundamental analysis. Fundamental analysis is a method used by investors and traders in financial markets to assess the intrinsic value of an asset or business by examining as most qualitative and quantitative factors as possible, such as company management and reputation, industry health, market capitalization, and other economic factors. The goal of fundamental analysis is to determine whether or not the price of an asset is overvalued or undervalued. Hoggle HODL is a term commonly used by cryptocurrency investors that refuse to sell their cryptocurrency regardless of the price increasing or decreasing. It is more frequently used during a bear market when people refuse to sell their coins despite the price drop. Mining Mining is the process through which cryptocurrency transactions are gathered, verified, and recorded into a digital ledger known as blockchain. The work done by miners is essential for maintaining the integrity of the network and is also responsible for introducing new coins into the system. Metaverse The metaverse is a concept of a persistent, online, 3D virtual environment that many believe will be a key element of future digital experiences. It has been called the Internet of Experience and the 3D Internet. It's believed to be a future iteration of the internet, where users will work, meet, game, and socialize virtually, and is closely associated with the concept of Web3. And if you want to know more about Metaverse, you can click the link above to get more information of what Metaverse is. Maximum Supply The maximum supply of a cryptocurrency refers to the maximum number of coins or tokens that will be ever created. This means that once the maximum supply is reached, there won't be any new coins mined, minted, or produced in any other way. Non-Fungible Token NFT. A non-fungible token is a type of cryptographic token that represents a unique asset. NFTs are tokenized versions of digital or real-world assets. They function as verifiable proofs of authenticity and ownership within a blockchain network. NFTs are not interchangeable with each other and introduce scarcity to the digital world. Overbought If a large number of purchases have been made on a cryptocurrency, its price will increase for an extended period of time. At this juncture, it is considered overbought and a period of selling is expected. Oversold If a cryptocurrency has spent significant time being sold without an upward movement, it is considered oversold. In this condition, there would be concerns about whether it will bounce back. Pump In cryptocurrency trading, pump refers to the price of a digital asset increasing, often at a faster pace or in larger moves than normal. Private Key A string of numbers and letters that are used to access your wallet. While your wallet is represented by a public key, the private key is the password you should protect. You need your private key when selling or withdrawing cryptocurrencies as it acts as your digital signature. Proof of Authority 
a private key that gives the holder the right to create the blocks in a private blockchain. It can be held by a single entity or a set number of entities. This is an alternative to the proof of work model, as instead of getting multiple random nodes to approve a transaction, a group of specific nodes given the authority can approve. This is a far faster method. Proof of stake. Another alternative to proof of work, this caps the reward given to miners for providing their computational power to the network at that miner's investment in the cryptocurrency. So if a miner holds three coins, they can only earn three coins. The system encourages miners to stick with a certain blockchain rather than converting their rewards to an alternate cryptocurrency. Proof of work. In order to receive a reward for mining a cryptocurrency, the miner must show that their computer contributed effort to approve a transaction. A variable is added to the process of hashing a transaction that demands that effort before a block can be successfully hashed. Having a hashed block proves the miner did work and deserves a reward, hence proof of work. Price action. Price action refers to the price movements of an asset over time plotted on a chart. Price action is the basis of all technical analysis, regardless of whether we're talking about commodities, stocks, bonds, forex, or cryptocurrency. Return on investment, ROI. Return on investment, or ROI for short, is a ratio or percentage value that reflects the profitability or efficiency of a certain trade or investment. Resistance. Resistance consists of a level in which the price of an asset fails to break through due to strong selling pressure. In some cases, the occurrence of resistance levels may also be related to big sell walls that prevent the price from rising further. Sell the rip. Sell the rip refers to a trading strategy that aims to sell an asset when its price has risen to a level considered overvalued. Stablecoin. A stablecoin is a type of cryptocurrency that is designed to maintain a stable market price. Recently, this type of digital currencies has grown in popularity, and we now have numerous stablecoin projects. Smart contract. A smart contract is a piece of computer software that is designed as an automated self-enforcing contract, which means it triggers certain action after predetermined conditions are met. Smart contracts can be used, for instance, as digital agreements that intermediate the exchange of cryptocurrencies between two parties. Once the terms of the agreement have been set, the smart contract verifies their fulfillment and the assets are distributed in accordance. Support. Support refers to a level that tends to hold the price of an asset, preventing it from going down. The occurrence of support levels is caused by a strong buying pressure at that price zone, but it may also be related to big buy walls that can make it harder for the price to drop further. Transaction ID, TXID. A transaction ID, or transaction hash, can be thought of as an identification number that labels each transaction on the blockchain. It is a unique string of characters that can be verified and added to the blockchain. Token. Tokens, generally speaking, are non-mineable digital units of value that exist as registry entries and blockchains. Technical analysis. Technical analysis, often referred to as charting, is a type of analysis that aims to predict future market behavior based on previous price action and volume data. The TA approach is extensively applied to stocks and other assets in traditional financial markets, but it is also an integral component of trading digital currencies in the cryptocurrency market. Volatility In finance, volatility describes how quickly and how much the price of an asset changes. Whale A term used to describe extremely wealthy investors or traders who have enough funds to manipulate the market. White Paper a document which serves as a report or guide to a complex issue. In the cryptocurrency world, white papers are used as a means of conveying a blockchain network or a crypto structure, plan, and or vision. Thanks for watching the video. If you found the content useful, please hit the like button and if you want to get notified of our latest videos, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell.